The demolition is now underway at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School. The 1200 building where 17 people died and the 2018 mass shooting is now being torn down. Local 10's Liam Woodhome joins us live from the school in Parkland. She tells us how long this demolition project will last. Well, this is expected to take weeks. 17 people were killed, 17 others injured, and countless in our community left traumatized. Let's go up above to Sky 10 where you can see the work to dismantle this building is now underway. This very visual reminder of the tragedy being stripped away bit by bit. They started on the northeast corner. Heavy machinery picking and chewing away at the 1200 building where the 2018 mass shooting at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School unfolded. 17 people were murdered. Officials opting for a slower demolition process over a swift implosion. It was cleared out beforehand. Belongings trapped inside for the last six years returned to their owners or surviving family. The 1200 building became the site of the nation's deadliest shooting at a high school. It was preserved as evidence through 2022 for the penalty phase trial of the shooter. Jurors toured the bloodstained building left untouched since the tragedy. His life sentence left some victims' families appalled and changed the way juries make death penalty recommendations in Florida from then on. Over the last year, the victims' families have also toured the building, as have members of Congress, Vice President Kamala Harris, school officials and law enforcement, the site becoming a piece of living history and a lesson on school safety. Like everybody here, we have one mission, stop the next one. It's expected to take weeks to remove the 1200 building. The memories and heartbreak left behind by the tragedy, however, are not as easily erased. So to bring down this building, they are first starting with the top floor, as you could see, and going bit by bit as you get to the bottom. There was a special section for family members of the victims and other community members to watch on campus as the building comes down. We're live in Parkland. I'm Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News.